Hey everyone, Stefan here. In this video, I'm gonna show you one of my favorite custom hotkeys for sculpting, which I've set up in Blender, and that is brush hardness. I have no idea why this isn't a default hotkey. I think it really should be, but thankfully it's actually very easy to set up, and here's how I did it. I have Blender 4.3 opened up right now, so the hotkey isn't set up right now because I'm still on 4.0. I'm waiting for the stable release of 4.3 to come out, so that's a perfect opportunity for me to just show you how I did it. So if we go into the key map and go right down to 3D view and sculpt, where is sculpt? There it is. And sculpt global. Now we can add this new shortcut. And let's say we can map this to control shift and F, which I've done in the other version of Blender, which I'm using. And now, just to make things easier, let's search by key binding Shift F. So this is going to give us any currently assigned hotkeys with Shift F, which includes Control Shift F. And we can expand this radial control hotkey, which is Shift F, which is used for brush strength. And just copy all of these down here, radial control. And all of these commands, just copy them right down, each in their corresponding uh, place. Image ID, okay. And just change strength to hardness. And we can copy this. Hardness and here. And now, if we go into sculpt mode, we have F. We have Control Shift F. If we go and let's test this out, let's uh, where's the masking brush in this in this version? There it is. So it's pretty soft. I use it for the masking brush uh, mostly, also for the painting brushes, sometimes for the grab brush. It's it's useful in a lot of cases. So let's say you don't like this soft brush for the mask, which I don't. So Control Shift F and just drag this right up, and now we get a nice sharp mask. And this works for every brush, right? So if we want to make this brush harder, it works as well, the standard brush. And this is very, very useful. Again, I have no idea why this isn't a default shortcut. It's, it's a default shortcut in ZBrush. It's a default shortcut in every painting application, which you, you've got a lot of painting brushes here as well. So yeah, until they add it, this is, I think, the way to go. So, happy sculpting.